Man City today. Um, it's, I mean, it's, it's a bit of a weird one because we got a game Sunday, quarter final against Everton, and I feel like we're going to be more focused on that. I feel like the team are going to be more focused on that. So, for example, to, like this evening, they ain't going to really be going in and doing any risky tackles, you know, risking getting injured themselves or just, you know, like doing anything stupid, like getting themselves sent off. It's going to be one of these games where. The, the, the team could mentally be like, look, we'll just try and get away with a 2-0, 3-0 defeat. Or we're going to really give it a go and fight. Players in the squad today are going to fight for a place in the team that will be picked against Everton this Sunday. So overall, it's a bit of a mixed sort of opinion on how the game today is going to go. I'm going to go over 2-0 with the City. We're not expected to win. They're going for the title. They can't afford any slip-ups. They're doing really well away from home. They've got a good winning record in recent times um, since we last beat them, which was in October. And we were the only team to beat them at the Etihad and Tottenham as well. But we, ain't, we haven't got a bad of a record away at Man City. It's at home. I don't think we've won against City since 2015. So it's been a while. But listen, um, I just want to see a bit of positivity. We just need to keep it tight, steady, man mark. And who knows? And score first as well. If we can score first, that's really going to put pressure on Man City. And it will leave them wide open at the back because they know they've got to try and get a couple goals in that. You know what I mean? So one other thing as well, the team lineup. So in goal for us is for Zedzai Guy to left back Mitchell, two centre backs to Guy and Anderson, right back Clive for the injured ward, midfielder Schlup, Kiate and Gallagher, the front three of Sahara, Lise and Mateta. So that I believe is the same team that played against Wolverhampton away. So he's gone with the same team, he's gone with a winning team. That's fair enough. On the bench, we've got Butland, Matthews, Ward, Tonkins, Rudeville, Ayu, Eze. Ben Teke and Edward City have got Edison, the starting. Cancelo is fit, surprise there. Laporte, Stones, Walker, Silva, Rodri, De Bruyne, Grealish, Foden and Mares. That is a strong team. They're going for it. <laughs> Stefan, Carson are on the bench. They've got two keepers, same as Palace, fair enough. Ake, Sinchenko, Fernandinho, Gunduan, um, Madep, I think that's how you say his name. I probably said it wrong. Um, Sterling and Gabriel Jesus. Blimey, that is some team for us to compete with. Come on, Palace. Pray to God we don't bloody lose. Uh, Dad, quick predictions. What are your thoughts? Just quick, um, like, quick five second one, prediction. <laughs> uh, three one to Man City. Got to get everything going coming up. Um, yeah, if we score yeah. first, we might. The teams just come out. The Man City team looks frightening, to be honest with you. Yeah. And I just think we're going to get overrun in the middle of the pitch. Yeah, I mean, we've already got Schlupp and Kiai. Uh, I, I don't in know. I think uh, I think Vieira is trying to be positive. Yeah, but, but the problem is, I think, if we he, get I think he might. I think he <laughs> might come a bit unstuck. Yeah. But we'll wait and see. We'll wait and see. Uh, I'm with James. What are your thoughts before the game? What are your predictions, um, my guy? What do you think? I want to say bad luck. Come on, what, bad what's your prediction? Today. No, it's bad luck. You see the ladder? No, I don't want to. All right, what, what are your predictions? Come on. I don't want to give one. You don't want, you've got to give Not one. Not today, no. To say, to say like... Uh, look at after half time, I'll show you how we do it. All right, all right, yeah, but trust me, I'm cutting myself for today's game after seeing that lineup. That's what I'm saying. So let's hope we don't get thrashed. Look at the way these man playing at all. Look at them. They're devastating. So smooth. Man. Great for you, Clay. Eels! Connor to Wilf, we saw one on one, but it dragged it too wide. Oh, well, come on. We we'll got many chances, and we've got to take them, man. Really poor play, attacking wise for us between Wilf and Gallagher. There. What a chance! What, what a chance, chance from Elise, just wide. Goal kick, but the goal was superb, man. Oh, should have scored that, man. We're not, we're not going to get a chance on that again. Yeah, end. other, other foot. Yeah, it was with his weaker foot, man. man. Oh man. Chance for City just there. It's a shot from the boy, a fumble by Guy, and then. I think it was Grealish or Foden, one of them two went down. I think they died or something, they just fell over, I couldn't tell. But. Come on, Will. 
playing really well. We're getting into the game a bit. Did start well, but waking up a little. Come on, Palace. Oh, ball that is. Come on, Mateo. Come on, Mateo. Come on, Mateo. What did he say? Oh! Come oh. oh, he slipped. So close. Oh, man. So close. Come on, man. We're doing well. We're very good at hitting Man City on the break there, man. I'm loving it right now. What are your thoughts on the game um, so far? We played well, but we've had a few chances where we should have not scored. Um, at least said, what a fake. <laughs> if he, oh, if he no. scored that, oh, it would have been mental. Oh, what a save, guys. What a save from White. Oh, it's just heading wide. Corner. City should have scored there, not going to lie. Quite open at the back. Honestly, what are your thoughts, Dad? Um, not bad start from Palace, you know, but Man City not playing, they're playing within themselves at the moment, but they've always got options when they're playing, yeah. you know, they've always got some of the positive. Very open right now, got a corner, come on Palace, just defend this man, keep it landmark, man, seriously. Oh, cleared away. Oh, deflected just wide, who was that had the shot, Foden? No, no one touched it! I feel like I took a deflection, I don't know, they're saying that no one touched it, but it's another corner. I couldn't really see well from here, no but no, apparently no one touched kick. it. No, no one, but fair the ref, enough. The ref didn't know. The referee the didn't know, the lines were included, I think, I don't know. Short corner taken from City here. It's out. It's so out. deep right now, I don't know why we're defending so deep. Foden with the shot there, what a save from Kaita. Oh my word! And I merit the port one of the misses of the season there, potentially. Blimey. Switched off Palace, but that was never a corner, according to all the Palace fans. I want to be a quad. Man City. Oh, it's not even that, we're just we're going for it, but defensively so open. They should be about possibly two up with a chance to miss. Giving it away at the same. It's a good save from Gaeta there, are they in against City? Who's this, the Broida? Oh shit, Foden. What a block! The Anderson, good block, whoever it was. Come on, man. I see it getting into it a little better now. Surprising he's just taking this, he's meant to be out to my left. He's a right winger. Yeah. Nah, not the best there. Uh, well, maybe not. Go on, Mateta. Go on. Uh, come on, come on, kick the ball, kick the ball, kick the ball, kick the ball, kick the ball. Kick the ball. Oh! oh! Just wide. So close. Wilf Saha! What a shot, just wide. Keep a dive. Good effort, man. What a first half from us. Let's just keep it nil nil before half time. We've got like five minutes left. Oh my. Great effort. A lovely pressure and pressing for Palace as well. Another chance in Man City there. Just looked like it hit the outside of the bar. And Curler, I thought he was in the back of the net. But Gay, instead of clearing her way out of the pitch and heading it back towards Schlupp on the edge of the penalty box, Schlupp at lost, lost the ball. And made a right mess of it nearly. Two minutes added on as well before half time. So that, you know what I mean? But it's been a good game of football. Just disappointed we're not be able to score yet. Great first half performance. Chance after chance for us and for City. Could be 2-2, two -two, could be 3-3 with the chances created, but very happy game. It's 0-0. Got to keep it tight and just got to perform like that in the second half and we'll get a result. Fingers crossed. What are your thoughts, lads, Dad? Uh, we've done alright. 0-0. Um, rode our luck a little bit. Had a few half chances and things, but they're playing alright, you know. More in the second half, but I think we might get a little bit tired and then you, you look at the Man City bench and you think, uh, but no, doing all right. What about you, James? Uh, I think we played well. Uh, Kiati come off. I think we. I would take him off. Would you take him off for half time? Yeah, yeah. take him off for half time. He's, he's, on he's injured. Well. And he's on a yellow. Yeah, uh, he's limping. So what can you do? Any other changes? Or just uh, keep the way of playing? Maybe Mateta. He he's looked promising, but then again, he has a brain at the same time. Well, what would you I think get? we played well. We just give them a few chances. If we keep playing like that in the second half, we could easily go one and all. Out of 10 on that first half, what would you give uh, it? Give it 6.5. Fair enough, fair enough. It's been two years since the half time penalty shootout. Has it been fun? There's a draw in the shootout, but. Okay, let's go, Pete. There's a slip. Oh, this is the game, Paul. It's going to go down to five. <laughs> What kind of shoes are those? Are they football boots? I think it would have bought, bought a pair of football boots if he would have known he was taking a penalty. sign. Oh no. Oh, is he taking it off? Oh no. <laughs> hey, he scores. What's the celebration? <laughs> man City sent out early. They must have torn into them at half time. Here come the Palace man. Come on. Let's just perform well like we did in the first half in the second half. Come on Palace. Yeah, 
Fogger. Fogger, Fogger. Oh, come on, 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 and Gallagher is definitely better than Grealish right now. <laughs> Man City, they should have, I don't know what happened, man. Bro. We didn't clear our lines. It was a shot for the boy to hit the post. Mares had a chance. And it was Stacey Pearley from Kaita. And it was offside. Boom to the point of effort at first when he hit the post. Brilliant bit of keeping there from Kaita, though. But we're getting tired, man. I think if I was here, I'd make a couple subs. Guys, I'm happy with that at time this time. Come on, just get the ball forward, Palace. We're so deep right now. Come on. Substitutions. Heads one off from Ateta. And Elise over I. It doesn't really surprise me at all because Elise looks a bit tired to be fair. Ateta, I'm not sure about that. I hope this pay off. That's what I've got to say. Come on, Palace. Come on, Eduardo. Come on, I. Come on, Palace. We've got that new rule. We forgot, we forgot, we forgot that you were here. We forgot that you were here. What are the thoughts, mate? What, what, what are we about to do? We need to step I'm it up. Yeah. We're going to do more. We're going to concede a little bit. We're the thoughts. We're still in the game. We're still there. I mean, we look tired. That's my worry. We look really tired out there at the moment. We should have faced the late kick on the floor. Come on, I. Oh, there's no one there, man. We've got to go out right now, man. It's not there. Oh, no. The Broyla has the ball now. What a ball that is with the Broyla. Hey! Offside anyway! Hey! Come on, a foul with the middle there, referee! Come on, man! A few minutes on time, Edouard was through. Didn't get a shot away and that took too long. Man, what a chance, man. You're going to get a chance in the second half like that again. If it was a Man City play, you wouldn't have dropped it. That's how you know the Premier League's kind of biased to the way these teams compared to last year, I'm saying. Oh, what a save, guys. I, I think they hit the ball on the hand. I don't know, but if it didn't, it was a top save. Gallagher, man. Oh! Left the pressure against Edison. Yeah! Side chip with the ball over him and it went over. So close. Come oh, on. for a fact, especially the way we sort of played in the second half, but keep it tight, man. Come on! Oh! Come on, we'll get back. We're so open right now. Greenish! You waste the money! Get lost! Cry in a minute! He's gonna cry in a minute! Oh, man. Yeah, but I think, oh, I don't think we'd be walking away from four, five, Yeah, man, loved Top it, man. <laughs> That's how it race for them is over, I think. Yeah, Liverpool fans will be thanking us. <laughs> what a point, a lovely performance in the first half. Second half, we sat back a bit, we were a bit tired, but we kept our shape. We kept believing, we showed passion. Um, this is a substitution I thought Vieira made a pretty good, bringing Ayu on later on just to hold the ball up and that, you know, just to ease the game. 
you know, for us and wind the clock down a little bit. We did time waste, I'll be honest, but I mean, I love it to be fair because Man City were absolutely fuming. Pep was fuming. Um, Jack Grealish, you saw at the end there, what a waste of money. He is a ball boy. Oh, the most, 100 million for a ball boy. Where'd you make <laughs> that, Man City? Huh? You paid 100 million yeah, for yeah. a ball boy. He's, he's done more. He's done more running getting the ball off the pitch for Thrones to get the ball back than anything. I mean, mm. <laughs> what a joke. Yeah, my coach is just texting me as well, giving us a well done because he's a Liverpool fan. That might have messed Manchester the City's tower hopes up big time, I'll be honest, because more points drop. Liverpool are on a, wi a win and roll. They got Arsenal on Wednesday night. They win that the one point behind City, I believe. And that's their game in hand as well. And if they win at the weekend as well, whenever or whenever the next playing, they'll go above Manchester City potentially, or they'll be on the same points as them or something. So yeah, it's gonna be a mad one, honestly. But now nah, listen, that is a brilliant performance from Palace. It's just as good as the Wolves one. We had a few we had a chance at the end, but I mean listen, it was difficult. Players were kind of knackered. City just about did enough to keep us prevent us from scoring but I tell you what man that would have gone in the place would have been going absolutely nuts I loved it man oh, honestly the atmosphere was good you know it was superb I should say it was absolutely brilliant